If you're anything like the clients that we work with every single day and have done for the past five years, you struggle to find the time and the motivation to work out consistently. You might start with really great intentions, but within two or three weeks of doing three to five workouts a week, pretty intense, you're not seeing the results you wanna see, you're getting fed up with it, you're getting tired, you're getting lots of aches and pains, you're not sure if what you're doing is working, so you stop. So today I wanted to share with you three tips on how to make sure that you work out consistently. Tip number one is to make a decision. And that may seem like a, a basic thing to say, but the way we work here is that once you've made a decision to follow a certain course of action, that decision is that, is that crucial thing which draws a line in the sand between who you are now or who you were before and who you want to be. And it puts you closer to being that person or being in that place that you want to be. And you might say, you know, Amy, yeah, I've made a decision before, I've done, I've done the training. But have you made that final decision that you are 100% going to commit to this and there is no going back, I'm getting to where I want to be and I'm going to do whatever it takes to get there. I'm talking about that kind of decision. Number two is to put it in your diary. So, you know, we live pretty scheduled lives, particularly if, you know, working long hours at a desk, corporate job, whether you're back in the office or not at the moment. Um, we live pretty pretty scheduled lives. So for me and for our clients, it works really effectively to make sure you've got your workouts in your diary. Not just in your diary, it's lip service, obviously, in your diary, taking it really seriously, that this is an appointment just the same as if it was an appointment with a client or a family member. I'm gonna show up for myself at this time, this day, this week, every week. Keeping it consistent really, really helps. Number three is get the accountability that you need. With the best will in the world, life gets in the way, things happen, we get tired, we get sick, we get frustrated, we get bored. If you've got the accountability to ensure that you hold yourself to that decision, that number one, that I am doing this no matter what happens decision, then you're much more likely to follow through on getting the results that you want. To get the results that you want, you've got to put the work in, you've got to put the time in, and having the accountability, whether that's a, a coach, whether that's a friend, a family member, um, a training buddy, makes it much more likely that you will get to where you want to be.